I'm Adam Gardner. I play guitar and sing in the band Guster. And I also co-founded an environmental group called Reverb. I think the most important issue facing us today environmentally is certainly global warming. Our band has done a lot to try to limit our impact on the, on the environment through making every show carbon neutral, putting biodiesel on our buses and trucks, using eco-friendly products backstage and on the bus, even simple things like using rechargeable batteries on stage or reusing guitar strings and making it into jewelry. We even sell a little carbon offset sticker for fans to offset their drives to and from the show to neutralize their emissions. In my own home, you know, I, I choose green power through my local utility. I try to walk as much as I can and not drive. Uh, obviously, replacing all the bulbs with compact fluorescent bulbs, which are more energy efficient. Even simple things like inflating your tires when you do have to drive uh, keeps the mileage up as far as miles per gallon. Not running the faucet when you're brushing your teeth. It just the simplest things can really make a difference. Reverb is a nonprofit group that my wife and I started in 2004 where we help other bands go green, coordinating local biodiesel suppliers to come and fill them up uh, at venues, helping them with their contract rider, with uh, eco-friendly products, looking at their carbon footprint of every show and, and making that carbon neutral by supporting renewable energy. Warner Music Group's done a good job as well with their packaging. We've helped them with their carbon neutrality. They made Guster's EP, our latest release, Carbon Neutral. If you want to learn more about Reverb, you can go to reverbrock.org. For me, it's all about everyone doing something, not every, you know, a few people doing everything. It's not all or nothing. I think it's important to just do something. If everyone did one thing, that would add up to a lot more than just a handful of hardcores doing everything.